Hey YouTube, it's Jurak Master, and I'm back with a new Jurak build. Um, this is not one that I'm going to be running myself, but it's kind of a continuation of two of the old ones. Um, this one uses Tyranno Infinity, as many of you like to see in a lot of dinosaur decks. Um, and it also uses a few macro elements. Um, so I think it should work out pretty well, uh, but I'm not going to run it. So I don't really have a side deck or an extra deck, I just have a few recommendations and I brought a few of them with me today to make this video. So uh, I'm just going to jump into the deck. It's 41 or 42 cards or something like that for anyone that wants to know. So first off, the Jurax. I have three Jurax Guaiba. Two Jurak Velo. And three Jurak Dino. Uh, not many Juraks in here, I know. What, eight of them? But it's enough. I don't really need any more. So, a couple more dinosaurs to keep it dinosaur like. I have three Hydrogen. And two Tyranno Infinity. So, now on to uh, the macro and other aspects of this deck. I have two Necro Gardena, one Necro Face, one Cyber Valley, one Eren, one Banisher, and one Black Luster Soldier. So, um, most of the time you're not going to remove everything on yourself, so you can manage so that you can get uh, Black Luster Soldier out. Uh, maybe Necroface returns all of your uh, removed from play stuff because your Tyranno Infinity is gone on you or something, and it ends up in the grave. Then you banish, and it uh, gets you more. I mean, remove from play cards for the next Tyranno Infinity. Uh, nice little cycle there. Uh, and when I say banish it, you probably banish it by using a Black Luster Soldier Summon. Uh, the spells, I have three Fossil Dig, two Forbidden Lance, one Monster Reborn, one Heavy Storm, one Dark Hole, one Burial from a Different Dimension, one Dimensional Fissure, and one soul absorption. So next up are the traps. Um, I'm running one solemn, two deep prison, one mirror force, two bottomless, one survival instinct, only one due to the fact that I have a lot of other ways to remove one return from the different dimension as a last resort kind of thing, one starlight road, and one macro cosmos. Um, so there are what, three ways to remove other than necroface and summoning black luster soldier. Uh, the deck seems pretty balanced to me. Um, I haven't really played it in real life, but uh, it, I think it works pretty well. So. Mainly, the only things I'd say you'd have to use in the uh, the extra deck would be at least one Levier. Because um, I modeled this thing to make Levier pretty easily. Let's see, I, I've got that. Banisher's in there for a reason. I have the two Necros. Those just are really abusable with that. That's why I have three Dinos. Um, I mean, that's it. What is that? Six monsters that can be used to bring it out. Seven, maybe, I don't know. Yeah, six. So, um, very nice. Uh, I will be, uh, well, now that I'm finished with the deck, I'm going to discuss a few other things with you guys. Um, I will be doing um, an update on my macro deck. Uh, it did pretty well at Locals this week. I got a kind of unlucky draws occasionally with it and lost one match because of it. Um, just couldn't get a macro card, couldn't get a search card. I just had bad luck, and I didn't have enough support in my back row. 
So, um, I mean, I'll be updating that. I've got, uh, I'm hollowing it out as, as I go. I already have the three secret Banisher of the Radiance, three Ultra Macrocosmos, and two secret, uh, uh, dimensional fissures. So that's nice. Um, I'm looking, uh, at getting Ultimate Caius's. I've got the Ultimate DD Survivors. And I only got gold spirit reapers for it, but uh, it's looking pretty nice. I didn't want to spend like the 60 bucks on each spirit reaper right now. If it were one, maybe it were, would be kind of reasonable, but it's three, so that's like $180. Um, and Caius is kind of expensive, but it's not nearly as bad, and I only need two. So as you can tell, I like the legendary collection cards. I've got my Hydro Gedons. I've got Cyber Valley, I've got all the macro stuff, uh, <laughs> I have a lot of the stuff, so um, I hope you guys enjoyed all of that legendary collection stuff, and um, another thing, I'm thinking of uh, getting an evil mat from the same place probably as I got this Jurak mat right here, um, let me just describe what I probably have on the evil mat, um, see right where it says Jurak Master? Um, there would be text there, I'll get what that would say in a minute. But what I'd probably do is, I haven't decided on the background yet, but, um, I'd have a background. I'd probably have two people here, they'd probably be Jurak Guaybos this time. And, um, right here, instead of Jurak Meteor, I'd have Evil Kaiser Lagia. And, um, and now on to what the text would say, it would say Jurak's Evolve. And, um... It, it looks like uh, I could make a pretty cool mat out of that. So uh, I want to know what you guys think, if you have any suggestions on what I should do to uh, design that mat. What the background should be, if you have any other suggestions, go ahead. Um, I think it, uh, it's looking like it could be a pretty cool mat. Um, I, knew, I do know there is another uh, Evil uh, Exceed. I believe its current name is Evil Zardakia. Um, for any of you that haven't picked up on it by now, Kaiser and Czar are like just uh, uh, whatever you want to call them, monarch-like names. Uh, the Kaiser would have been German and the Czar would have been Russian. Uh, just so uh, you guys know, if you didn't catch a, catch that in originally looking at these guys, especially just a giveaway when they made Evil Zardakia. So um, I'm, I will be making that Evil deck... Uh, I don't, I'm hesitating on whether or not I should actually buy the playmat because it would be $50. And um, as you guys might have picked up from this video, I did actually buy the stuff for the macro deck. Um, I don't think I'm buying any more hollowed out. I will trade for them if I can find them, but I don't think I'll buy any more anytime soon. Mainly because I have Modern Warfare 3 coming out. And I have um, the entire Evil deck to buy with the addition of a new Evil Exceed. And I'm going to be getting them most likely probably the day they come out. So, and not just the day they come out, I mean the day of the, the sneak. So, um, I hope you guys enjoy that, me getting them as soon as possible and making that deck profile for you as soon as I can. Um... So I hope you guys enjoyed this deck. Look for, uh, look for an updated uh, macro deck with side deck and everything because the side deck is pretty important. Um, I don't know when I'll be able to do that because I do need dark bribes for it and I don't have them right now. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh, didn't mind me talking about the future of my channel for a little bit here. And um, yeah, I really do hope you guys enjoyed and have a nice day.